video is going to be a story time so i'm going to be telling you a story while doing my makeup as you can see i don't have any makeup on my face so that is going to be our video today but before i start telling you this story i need you to know that from this story of today you're going to learn a lot of things concerning relationships and if you find yourself in a situation like this, then you'll know a way out. Or even if it doesn't happen to you, if it happens to someone that you really care, you'll be able to advise this person that take this tape before it's too late. So let us start our story. So guys, our today's characters are going to be a woman and a man. The lady is called Catherine. And this story guys is a true story that happened here in Italy so a lady is called Catherine and the boyfriend is called Daniele Italian <laughs> an Italian guy so uh, we'll start with Catherine before she met the boyfriend Catherine was a very beautiful woman a woman that uh, likes to do a lot a very busy woman so one day Catherine was going to a mall for shopping and she was with her friend as they arrived at the mall before entering the mall she saw two guys who were also going to the mall they stopped them and they started talking to them and one guy showed a lot of interest in Catherine she, he was he was asking a lot of questions and Catherine was answering them you know Catherine was still single she was not in a relationship you know as ladies if you're not in a relationship and maybe you are wishing to be in a relationship uh you'll be nice to guys <laughs> so she became nice to this guy and so they exchanged phone numbers and um, they continued chatting after that and eventually they met and they are so happy to meet each other after that meeting at the first meeting at the mall so they talked, a, they talked a lot and they shared a lot in common. The meeting went very well. Catherine returned home and from there they started meeting more. They started having more meetings. <laughs> and eventually they decided to start dating as girlfriend and boyfriend so they started dating everything was going so well they were all crazy about each other and Catherine was really really happy because at her age she was 29 years old at her age she really really wanted someone and God answered her <laughs> by bringing Daniele so uh as the relationship got serious Catherine decided to introduce Daniele to her mother first you know <laughs> if you have a mother you know most of our mothers are our best friends so she decided that when the father isn't at home she's going to introduce Daniele first to her mom and that is how it happened she introduced Daniele to the mom and the mother was happy to see that Catherine has found someone that she really really loved but at the same time Catherine's mother did not like Daniele and the reason is the mother said that the first time she met Daniele when uh, Catherine 
brought him to introduce him, she saw coldness in the eyes of Daniele. She saw a lot of coldness in his eyes. I don't know why, but that is what Catherine's mother saw when she first saw Daniele. But she did not say anything to her daughter yet. She kept quiet about it, but it is something that she felt that the guy was very cold. Which means she suspected that Daniele wasn't the right man for her daughter, but she did not want to tell Catherine because it could have broke her heart. She was madly in love with Daniele. So they continued dating and everything was so fine. Eventually the father met Daniele, the father of Catherine met Daniele and also Daniele introduced Catherine to his family. So Catherine and Daniele decided to start living together before they get married. By the way, guys, a lot of guys here in Italy likes to stay with a girl first. Like they live together first, then they get married after. Most Italian men like it that way. So that is how they chose to start their life together. And then they'll get married. Oh, so like I told you, Catherine was a very busy lady. She was doing modeling. She was employed. She had a business. So she continued her life like that. They continued living their life happily with each other. Nothing was really, really wrong. And the couple, the couple's relationship was really going very strong. So uh, one time, Catherine had a dinner with her friends and she decided to take Daniele along, you know, so that all of the friends can meet Daniele. And they went and when they arrived, she introduced him. The friends were happy to see Daniele. You know, if you have your friend and you really, really like your friend, if you see any progress in your friend's life, you're going to be happy for your friend. And that is what happened. The friends were really, really happy for Catherine. But, 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 <laughs> after that dinner, some of the friends told Catherine that they suspected Daniele wasn't the right man because the other day at the dinner he was present physically but mentally he did not seem like to be present and from there the friends were like we don't think if this guy is the right person why is he like that why was he acting like that but Catherine did not listen at all to the friends and she took Daniela's side that no nothing is going on I really love him he gives me everything that I want he takes care of me so he is the right man for me and as I said if you really love your friend you have to also respect their decisions you can always give the advice but you cannot tell your friend that you must do this no if she decides to take this way then you have to support her <laughs> that is how friendship is true friendship so guys it passed four months after they've been living together as a couple and Catherine found out that she was expecting a baby and when she found out Daniele wasn't at home she was alone at home 
so she was so happy and she was like i want to make this special like a special announcement because she was very sure that daniela is going to be happy about the baby's news and they arranged for dinner but that dinner wasn't at the restaurant no it was the dinner at home so after they have had their dinner then Catherine decided to break the news to Daniele that she was expecting as soon as she told Daniele that she was expecting the baby Daniele seemed very disturbed guys he seemed so disturbed he did not like the news in fact he told Catherine that you must abort this baby I'm not ready to be a father Catherine was really surprised and she told Daniele that you know what I'm not going to abort this baby you should know this now that I'm not going to abort and Daniele insisted that you are going to abort this baby if you really want to continue the relationship with me remember they were not married yet so the baby's news came as a bad news to Daniele and from there Catherine started being sad that why is that Daniele wasn't happy of her being a mother and it and he is saying that she should abort the baby but she did not share this information with anyone she kept it with herself and one day they were sleeping it was around midnight Daniele woke up Catherine like wake up wake up wake up then she woke up and Daniela told Catherine that you know what you have to return to your parents house I'm not ready to continue the relationship with you I think I made a mistake I don't feel love anymore so pack your bags and leave my house now I'm going to drop you at your parents house then Catherine was very very surprised of what Daniele was telling her that as she continued asking him what is going on why then she realized that Daniele was really serious that she should leave his house so she packed all of her bags and left the house she left the house crying a lot she was crying so much because it is not something that she expected you know we women when we are in a relationship with a guy we know he's the one so if something happens then it really really brings you down she stayed at her mother's house for Two months and then afterwards Daniele again started asking her out and eventually they returned back together <laughs> so the pregnant was really really growing and Catherine asked Daniele that we should get married because I don't want to have my baby out of marriage so we need to really get married and start our family but guys Catherine was very happy because she was going to be a mother and that is why she wanted to get married to Daniele so that they can be a complete family even in the eyes of God Daniele accepted he told her 
that is a good idea yes i think you're right we should get married so they arranged for a meeting to go and meet Catherine's parents to tell them that they are planning to get married so they went and they had dinner after dinner then they talked to the parents that they were planning to get married but do you know the reaction of, of these parents they told them that especially the mother the mother told Catherine that I don't think you should get married because you are pregnant that shouldn't be the right thing you can still raise your baby even if you're not married there is no need to hurry to get married but both of them were like no we are ready we want to get married then the parents said okay if it is what you have decided but we were thinking that you shouldn't hurry into marriage so they agreed all and the wedding plans started so the wedding plans started and everything was going very very good as planned i mean the venue they paid for everything the food everything guys as the normal wedding one day was left for them to get married again Catherine's boyfriend which is Daniele woke up at night told her that you know what Catherine I've changed my mind let's call off the wedding I'm not ready to marry you and I think I'm not the right person for you <laughs> oh my god Catherine was like what is wrong with you or maybe it's just you know the wedding stress and all that don't worry everything is going to go well as planned it shouldn't stress you much it's only tomorrow we we'll get married and everything is going to be fine but Daniele insisted that no, I don't want to marry you let us call off the wedding he insisted but this time Catherine did not want to listen to Daniele we have to get married we must get married because we have paid for everything and everyone have the invite so we cannot call off this wedding she even begged Daniele to change his mind to continue with their wedding and she succeeded guys she succeeded and the day of the wedding arrived they went to the church they got married Catherine was really really happy because that was her dream <laughs> you know as women getting married is one of our dreams so it was a very very good day for Catherine and you could see her face at the wedding but Daniela's face guys even in the photos they took this guy was not smiling he never smiled <laughs> he was there but not there physically the body is there but his mind was really out of that place and everyone could see that in Daniela's eyes that Daniele wasn't there mentally but you know it's the wedding day so people should celebrate instead of concentrating so much on Daniele's face the fact that he came and they got married so time passed and Catherine had her baby and it was a girl a very cute baby they were really really happy but Catherine was really really more happier about her baby because 
being a mother is beautiful guys it's so beautiful so that is why Catherine was very happy the parents were also so happy that they have become grandparents so they continued their life but Daniela's side Daniela started cheating he started cheating with women at the place where he worked different women every new woman that could come at work like a new employee Daniela could go out with that woman he could do everything to make sure that he goes out with that woman so he was cheating but Catherine did not know anything and about the baby Daniela never never played with this baby never he could return from work he sits on the computer or television even if the baby says daddy can we play together Daniele never played with this baby so Catherine raised this kid herself like a single mother she was married yes but she was raising her kid as a single mother because the father never participated in anything in the upbringing of this baby but as you know they are married so after having that one baby came another baby and the parents too were so happy because the family was growing Daniele mm, not so much but what can he do he's married already <laughs> but he continued his games he even started buying prostitutes and the most worst part is that Daniele could take videos of these prostitutes when they meet as in when they're in that intimacy situation he could take videos of those prostitutes but all of this Catherine discovered anything so for Catherine they never had any problems apart from the other time the husband told her that they should call off the wedding but everything continued normally and it's because Catherine's mind was more focused on the kids and she was happy because she was married that is all she wished for so she did not want to pay attention at the way this man is behaving if she could have paid attention on the way Daniele was behaving then I think she could have discovered something very early so time went by and um, one day Daniele Daniele gave the phone to the son because the son wanted to watch cartoon on the phone and he gave his phone so the baby continued watching the cartoon until the baby was going to bed so Catherine had to take the phone from the baby so that the baby can sleep and when she took the phone she said something came into her mind that she should take a look <laughs> at his husband's phone and when she checked she almost collapsed because she found those videos of those prostitutes she started crying she did not believe that Daniele could really cheat on her but that was that was it he was cheating on her 
for so long. So Catherine called her mother and told her everything that has happened. And the mother advised her that I think you should leave this man. He is not the right man for you. So Sophie has woken up. You know Mama Nambacho? Mama Nambacho 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 M